What's up? This is a really quick update on the 90s blues by DJ Short Seeds. This is sprouting day three. They were germinated on the 28th of December and they were planted into cocoa on the 30th. Both of those took place at 9 p.m. at night. So look right here. You can see what's going on right now. It's like 7 a.m. by the way. So it's like barely the next morning uh, after four days. But right here you can see the water on the top of the, 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 the plant itself and you can see the seed husk at the bottom of it. This, this number one, this is the one that I had posted about earlier that kind of looked like it was um, like a eggplant and cherries, if you know what I mean. So the cherries was the seed husk at the bottom. And if you look over at the right, you can see that little, um, this little thing right here. I don't really know the correct scientific term of it. I honestly don't know but it's like a protein or something I, I assume that was on the tip. It's the inner side of the, uh, of the seed husk. And I think it was, you know, it was on the tip. It was on the tip of the plant, which made the whole plant look kind of funny. Um, so that's, that, that was that. If you didn't see that post, maybe go check out some of my other posts and you'll see what I'm talking about. I thought it was pretty freaking funny. Um, but anyways, look at the stock, man. The stock is thick. This is already thick. This is really good genetics. Uh, this is number two over here now. Again, really good genetics. Look at this. Look at the thickness of that stock. I don't know. Maybe it's just the video that makes it look thick. Maybe everything's thicker on video, right? Don't you gain 10 pounds on video? Something like that? I don't know. Hey, look, there's that protein thing down there in the bottom right. Um, I don't know. Is it protein? What is the thing? What is the inner shell of the seed? I assume it's some type of protein or something that allows the plant to kind of get some food like as it starts to grow. You know what I mean? But honestly, I should look this shit up before I post because like before I make these videos so I sound more educational. I mean, I try to be educational, but a lot of this is just what I've picked up over like 20 plus years of doing this. Like it's funny. I actually started growing before YouTube even existed. Like some people think I learned this stuff from watching YouTube videos. No. I started, I started growing well before YouTube even existed. So yeah, anyways, I don't know why I got onto that topic. Much love, thank you for watching, I appreciate it. This is 90s Blues, numbers one and number two, DJ Short Seeds. Oh yeah, I just took the humidity domes off just a little while ago. Uh, I'm gonna let them try to get a little bit used to the regular air. I might even turn this fan that I have right here that's currently on some of the other clones. I might actually turn the fan towards them so they get a little bit of a stiffness. You know what I'm saying? Get the thickness on the stiffness, the stiffness on the thickness of the stock. Um, I don't know what I'm saying, but yeah. They're looking good. I think they're looking really good. I got these seeds the, from Oregon Elite Seed Bank. Check them out. I, I don't know if they still have any more of the 90s blues, but I was really excited to see that they had them. Oregon Elite Seed Bank has a lot of rare uh, rare finds. I think it's really interesting. It's not like uh, a lot of the other seed places where they just have like all the different strains and stuff. Like It's more like designer strains from designer... Um, designer breeders you know what i mean the stuff that organ elite seed bank it has is really cool anyways just a short little plug from them again not sponsored i just like their product so much love thank you have a great day and peace out